Before I lost weight, I was borderline high blood pressure, borderline diabetic, borderline high cholesterol. I was taking an inhaler three to four times a day. When I saw a video of myself sitting on the floor with my daughter learning how to walk towards me, that was my aha moment that I needed to do something. The next day I called Dr. Kipnis's office and requested a consultation for the gastric sleeve surgery. By working in the operating room at Jersey Shore, I knew his reputation was very high and, and he had very good patient rapport. When I first met Erin, she had no previous operations. She had a very high BMI. Performing her operation robotically was logical in order to give her the best operation, the quickest recovery, and to have the operation done in the most efficient manner that we can. It offers a certain advantages to the patient as well as advantages to me as the surgeon. It requires less assistance, I control everything, and that's really been a general trend uh, in the world of surgery. I was excited about the robotic surgery because it was less healing time and it was less time for me that I was going to be out of work. Two weeks after surgery, they're kind of back to normal and they're dropping a fair amount of weight. I would encourage anybody to have the gastric sleeve surgery. If I was that person looking at YouTube videos and testimonials and before and after pictures and videos of what their transformation was and that was my motivation to keep pursuing this. She's lost a lot of weight, she's very happy. Those medical problems that she was concerned about are nowhere near her. I 200% feel that this surgery changed my life. I have lost, since having surgery two years ago, a total of 150 pounds. I feel proud of myself that I pushed myself this hard to get where I'm at now. This isn't just a short-term fix. We want people to be successful for the long term and continue to maintain their health over time. My entire adult life I was overweight, severely overweight, and I just kept getting bigger and bigger and bigger until I finally said, I can't do this anymore. I needed something, I needed to change something.